Kids who were recently homeless needed your help this holiday season, and boy, did you deliver. Thanks to our CBS 8 viewers, nearly 100 children living in an apartment complex for veterans and their families will have the best Christmas ever. In fact, the party is in full swing, and that's where we find CBS 8's Anna Laurel right now. Anna? <laughs> All right, this is the happiest place on earth right now. There are about 100 kids who are coming into this room and they get to pick out not just one toy, but three toys. And it's all because of you at home that this is happening right now, like this. <laughs> An epic Christmas party. What is that? A Monet. A room full of toys. The man says upstairs, you have not because you asked not. And uh, I went on and like I said, I told these kids that we we're going to have a good Christmas and, and today what? We're going to have a good Christmas. This is my magic key. And it's all for the kids at this apartment complex, just for people experiencing homelessness or low income. Dozens of the families here were homeless vets, mothers like Army veteran Heather DeMarco. We would literally be homeless right now if we would not have this place. I would probably be uh, on the street in a car or in a hotel. Instead, her nine-year-old daughter and other children are getting to pick out several gifts they've always wanted. Gifts they would not have without this Christmas party. Baby doll. The kids walked into a room full of dinosaurs, games, bicycles, Barbies, and baby dolls. People donated gift cards for the teenagers, homemade cookies and milk, and just in time for the party, a Porsche filled with pizza. It's a Porsche filled with pizza, yes. With me working in politics, sometimes I see the ugly side of things, and this whole week, and then especially today, um, I'm just seeing the beauty in people. Aramid Glass Blake helped make this party happen. She collected your donations all week, even drove them over in a U-Haul. Today, I think this community, this apartment complex, children of veterans and formerly unsheltered children um, will see um, that they are seeing today. The look on these children's faces tell you how happy they are in this moment. But these gifts send a greater message. We're on the, the lower scale of income. We feel forgotten. Um, and whenever we see this, we like, okay, wow, we do matter. We, we still are a part of the community. They matter. They feel loved. They feel Christmas. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. We can't thank you enough. In Southcrest, this is Anna Laurel for CBS 8.